Okay, folks, I am here in La Jolla at the base of Soledad Mountain, or Mount Soledad. I don't think we can see the cross from here, but I'm not going to back out into the road because it's La Jolla Parkway and it leads to two different freeways right from here. So people start really moving quickly to head up and down the hill. So I'm going to stay away from there and head up the uh, the hill this way, or it's pretty much a hill. It's only something like 820 feet above sea level to the summit. But um, So I am going to continue on up because this is the only mountain I've ever hiked where I started from the top and came down, and then I'm going to go back up to where I parked up at the top. So I'm going to show you what it looks like from here on this Hike or Die San Diego County video of Mount Soledad, coming up now. Okay folks, Hike or Die San Diego back with you here in La Jolla at the foot of Mount Soledad. And this is the end of a road called La Jolla Scenic Drive South. And you can see that the marine layer has primarily been broken up by the coast right along the coast now and um, it's beginning to be a nice day along the the um, by the beach I think I mean as far as I can see from here I'm not down there but it looks pretty good but I am going to be going up away from the beach because I've just found this trailhead at the end of this road so this would be a good place to park except for what does it say there it says no parking first and third Thursday 7 a.m. to 11 a.m. street sweeping sorry I'm trying to get away from the wind I can hear it whipping around so but I am gonna be going back up right there that's where the trailhead is and it gets a little steep as it goes up over by the power lines and back up towards the summit and I will show you some of those views in a moment when I get up there all right, later. Okay, folks, Hiker Die San Diego, back with you here at the first significant high point along the trail going up to Mount Soledad. You can see off in the distance there, that is the Scripps Pier, La Jolla, and La Jolla Shores is to the left, and heading up from the Scripps Pier, that's Black's Beach, and then as you can see off the marine layer is still sticking around around the area of UCSD where all that first set of buildings right there is and as we go along we can see more of those buildings over in La Jolla and then as we go along getting closer to University City and there's the, uh, the Mormon temple there right near the freeway or the, the LDS temple I should say and then the, I don't know if you can see that big ridge in the background. That is Palomar Mountain. It just, it's a huge ridge mountain. It just goes straight across Mountain Ridge. And then uh, that one with the communications towers there, it looks kind of like a volcano. It probably was one, is Black Mountain on the, in the back of those buildings there. And then we just go along. You can't see too much more. It's, it's pretty hazy, and we can see... Right there is uh, Mount Woodson, and then Iron Peak right over there. You can barely even make it out. I can barely see it with my eyes. Never mind what you'll be able to see on the camera. But anyway, the trail keeps going up that way, and I'm going to continue on. All right, later. Okay, folks. Hike or Die San Diego. Back again with you here along the trail of Mount Soledad. And we can just see it as we, as I panned over there, we were, I could show you off in the distance, it's hard to tell, but all the way to the right, that is Otai Mountain. And then that next highest peak in the forefront is Mount San Miguel. I don't know how well you can see it. Um, that is Mount Helix. And then you can probably see better the peaks of mission trails going from east to west we have coals piles quai pai 
South Fortuna and then finally North Fortuna. And then you can see way off in the distance uh, El Cajon Mountain and Cuyamaca Peak as we go across Poway Iron Mountain and Mount Woodson and back across again over the buildings of University City, Black Mountain and some of these other peaks over there in North County and of course the giant ridge of Palomar in the background and then the rest of the beautiful neighborhood of La Jolla and then we can start to see you know that that uh, well, what's it called right there? The Manzanita is blocking the view of the ocean for the most part, but you can see it on the, in the background. And I'm gonna head, speaking of back, head back up the trail here. There's some more scrub oaks along the way. I love scrub oaks. All right, folks, later. Okay, folks, at this point in the trail, we get our first view of the controversial Mount Soledad cross. I apologize if it's a little noisy with the wind, but there's not much I can do about that. But as we work our way along, we can see our, the view of Mission Beach and Point Loma. And as you go along, I've crossed the tops of those <coughs> eucalyptus trees there. <clears throat> Excuse me. Then we can see the San Diego city skyline, all the buildings of downtown in the area. And uh, as they go along south and east, once again, we can see the Mexican border there. Or even probably some of those mountain peaks are in Mexico. And then our own Otay Mountain there. And once again, all the mountains, the prominent peaks of San Diego County. And then there's the 52 freeway down there heading east to Santee. And then more of the prominent peaks. And that's Rose Canyon right there. And there is the 5 Freeway North. Heading up the coast. All right, later. Okay, folks, I am here at the steps of Mount Soledad, the, memorial, the Veterans Memorial Cross. And I am going up, and I am going to take a look at what is on the plaque here. And we can read it. I can read it to you. And it says, Mount Soledad Veterans Memorial Cross, dedicated in 1954 as a tribute to all branches of armed forces of the USA, service men and women. The plaque dedicated November 11, 1989, Mount Soledad Memorial Association, City Beautiful San Diego. Sounds kind of awkward, but anyway, this is the top, and um, you know, I always talk about all oh, this is that and that's that and point out these things, but I've already done that and talked too much most of the entire video, so I'm just going to be quiet and let you take a look at the beauty of the entire county, or most of the county of San Diego. Okay, folks, hike or die, San Diego County. Still on top of Mount Soledad, where the Veterans Memorial is. And this is one that I actually recognize. Richard J. Stack, Captain, U.S. Army, previously U.S. Marine Corps enlisted. And it shows his, uh, his significant military um, badge badges he's achieved and operational medals in Afghanistan and and Kosovo 
and uh, some of the pictures from his military service. He, the reason why I bring him up, he was my, he was my platoon leader for a, a short period of time when I first came into the California Army National Guard back in 2008. And um, I mean, I don't remember much about the guy. I know, you know, he had that Marine Corps attitude and all that sort of thing. But, um, but yeah, I, I, other than I looked, tried to find the circumstances of his death, but I was never able to, to find anything online. So I don't know if anybody out there in my audience knows who he is. Uh, I have much of an audience, but hey, it's growing. If uh, you know the circumstances of Captain Stack's death, if you could send me a message and let me know, that'd be great. All right, this is Hiker Die San Diego coming to you from Mount Soledad. All right, folks. Later. Okay, folks, so if you don't want to miss another one of my hiking videos, then go ahead and hit that bell.